caught me. Hi, how are you? It's Mimi here at Kids Stories and More, and we are going to do some Wake Up With Mimi. It is 7 a.m., at least on the East Coast, and I'm so glad you joined us. I hope you enjoyed all the activities from last week, and we have some more for this week. So let's get into it. Um, I'd like you, if you're at school, to grab a book or any object, crayons, stuffed animals. If you're at home, same thing, anything that's nearby. It doesn't have to be anything big or heavy. I had this book that I was going to do a read aloud with, so I'm going to use this. We're going to learn about positional awareness, okay? We're going to do activity with phrases that I'm going to give you and you're going to have to figure out where it goes. So for example, um, on top, next to, underneath, below, you're going to have to know where to put your object, whatever it is. Okay, so let's start, let's practice. Put the object on top of your head. See, got it? Okay. Put the object below your feet. Where would that go? Oh, you guys are so smart. Good job. Put the object next to you. Where would that go? You got it. Next to. It could be on either side, but it's next to you. It's right alongside. Put the object up. Whee! Good. Put the object behind you. That's right. When something goes behind you, it goes, it's facing your back. That's behind. What about in front of? Put the object in front of you. Well, if this is behind, what would in front of be? <laughs> Nicely done. Object is in front of. That's facing your, the front of you, your face, the stomach, in front of. How about put the object below? Do you remember? Mm-hmm. Put the object to your left. Ooh, the left. Ooh, that could be hard. Do you remember we had a video on left and right? Oh, some of you got it. Now, remember, I'm your mirror image, so my left is your, gonna be your right. Because if I was faced this way with my back to you, my left would be here. But because when I turn to face you, it's on this side, to the left. So, Put the object now to the right. Very good. Hold the object in front of you. Smart. Hold the object behind you. Right. Very good. Put the object above you. Above. Well, let's see, planes fly above us, so that must mean, that's right, it's above me, way above me, a little bit above me. Put the object on the ground, on the ground. Put the object, how about we try and balance the object? That could be interesting. What do you think? All right. Balance the object 
on your elbow. Mm. Ooh. Ooh, I saw two different ways to do it. Some of you did it this way and others of you did it this way. Either way works. Nicely done. Oh, did somebody go like this? Oh, that's harder. That's hard. Good. All right. Balance the object on your back. Ooh, how would we do that? Let's see if I can do it. Were you able to do it? Nice job. Thank you for sharing a few minutes with me. I hope that cleared up next to, beneath, on top of, above, behind, below. A lot of different ways to communicate where something goes. But you did a fabulous job. Give yourself a round of applause. Nice. I will see you tomorrow for another brain break or brain challenge. You never know what's coming. See you tomorrow. Please like and share. Thank you.